drink. <laughs> Look at me now, Ma. Silk guns and fireworks. Hey, guys. I just wanted to warn you about some shady characters selling bad... Yo, wait a second. Fighters here. Get out of the void. He ain't losing the equipment. Birthday, Lex. Was that you? Oh man, I hope Mike saw that in the hospital. Lex would have loved it. Hope y'all enjoy your time in New York. Stay safe. Disaster befalls our beautiful city. And guess who's to blame? In what sh could have been a ruler. Keen prison transfer. The Spider-Men felt the Quiet. Still no sign of Lee. Or the gang that took him. Wonder if Pete's having better luck than me. Hey Pete, you ready to come by the foundation? Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. Oh, gotta grab this call from MJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry, and this foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA-level stuff. Yeah. Whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter, fur vest looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job, too. Okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, 
They could really use your webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely. Thanks. We'll keep working until you get here. was. You made it! I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker! <laughs> so, what do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. And now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him decide for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. <laughs> so the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this Place. Right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... Got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. To heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Yes, this is Catherine. Who may I ask is calling? Oh, of course. Put him through. Dr. Mulligan, I'm at work. Is everything Here, really follow me. The well, data does not cross tab debate with the AI learning we did during the last milestone. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. It's so nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator, the carnivorous bee wolf. So we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? This is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that we're training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not hurt them. Oh, oh nice! Coming for you, people! Yes! Yep! Oh, yeah! Gotta protect the hive! Nice! Bee Patrol on duty! You're not gonna mess with my bees! You're done, Peter. A very productive session. We got great data. 
Okay, flying home. Welcome to entomology. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. A moment, if you please. Uh, any chance I can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh, yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call, but uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. So that was crazy. I mean but it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. I guess I'll look around. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. Wonder how it ended up here. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. A reminder that the sustainable energy The origins of life on Earth remain a mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non-biological chemical compounds? see what's going on here. Maybe I can help. Oh yeah, that would take a while. I'm not sure there's time to dig in now, but I'd sure like to come back and work on this later. So many cool things here. <clears throat> Looks like Connors is putting the research he did after he lost his arm to good use. I wonder if he regrets testing that serum on himself. It must be unnerving walking around with dormant lizard DNA in your body. I, I know the numbers Welcome to entomology. Drones? Yeah, uh, doing a little cross-collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. Ultralight drones using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will, by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. <laughs> 